Hi, and welcome to the Electronics and Programming Beginner's Guide. Today we're going to do something a little out of the ordinary. We're going to do an unboxing here. Uh, what this is, is a hacker box. This is a, a monthly subscription. I believe it normally runs about $44 a month. Uh, you can see the uh, their hacker box symbol is right there uh, the idea behind hacker box is that they send you little uh, you know a collection of little goodies to do projects with fun uh, fun things etc maybe even tools or something like that and i have not opened this yet so we're going to be uh, looking at it together so let's have a look see So we've got some nice black uh, tissue paper in here, like that. And there's a card in here that I believe the idea behind the card is to kind of explain the things that uh, they're sending to you. That uh, uh, this is box 0015, connect everything and uh, Attend H4X0R Skull Hacker. If I understand correctly, I think this is like a cube you dissolve and it becomes uh, a cup of coffee. Then back here we have a ESP32 dev kit. So let's have a look see inside. Uh, this guy here, uh, let me open it up uh, this is a screen oh these anti-static bags are always kind of a nightmare to get through when they're open and so this is a little mini screen has like a protective uh, film on it and VCC GND SCL SDA this looks like a uh, I squared C screen very nice uh, this is that uh, dev kit that was pictured here. This anti-static bag is already open. Like that. Uh, this looks like maybe Wi-Fi or Bluetooth. Does it say in here? Uh, no, it does not. That uh, You can clearly tell by the uh, metal can here and the uh, little traces over here that this is something wireless related, whether that's Wi-Fi or Bluetooth or Zigbee or something else. Uh, I guess we will find out at a later time. Then the comes with a USB cable because there is a uh, micro USB port on here. This is probably for uh, programming it. Then we have a... This is an audio jack uh, breakout board. I was actually working on some audio stuff, so this uh, might be helpful here in the very near future. Ooh, that's interesting. Uh, this is a, a button array. So the idea being is that if you need a keypad for your project or something like that, that all of these are probably matrixed together. It looks like where uh, you apply power to some of these and ground to some of them and by reading which one goes low you can tell which button was pressed then what do we have here Ooh, I, if i had to bet these are neopixels gcc vcc in gcc out so what a neopixel is I don't know if that's necessarily the uh, brand name for these. So uh, what these are, are lights and they are programmable. You apply power, power, ground and a data signal. And through the data signal, you can actually program different light patterns on them. Or at least that's how the NeoPixels work. I'm guessing these are very similar. We have some HackerBox stickers. Ah, there we go. Those were the uh, the cubes. So two cups per packs. Oh, so the, these are chewable coffee. It looks like the. I'm kind of interested too. So it says uh, two cubes per pack, chewable coffee.
There are three different flavors, pure dip, mocha, and latte. A uh, Goat Cubes combined finely brewed taste with a special blend of ingredients that enhance uh, caffeine for focused energy on the go. Hmm. Interesting. I, I didn't think they sent food, but I guess they do. And some jumper wires. These actually look pretty decent. I've, I've seen some pretty shitty wires in my day. Ooh, and it looks like there's a little... So the ESP32, which is, which is this guy, is Bluetooth and Wi-Fi. Connect everything. Hmm. That'll be interesting to play with. Uh, the chip on it looks like an SI Labs chip. Hmm. And uh, that looks like it. So uh, that's that was uh, Hacker Box number fifteen, and uh, most likely you'll see some of these in uh, my upcoming projects. Uh, thank you for watching. Uh, if you have any questions, you're always welcome to leave them in in the comment section down below.